definitely a congressman I remember, many of whom were saying, you've got to come to us. You're going to come to us. We need to be part of this. So the president decided to go to Congress. Now, in the intervening time while Congress was deliberating, and by the way, Congress became far more difficult to persuade than anybody thought they would be. But while that happened, I was asked at a press conference in London, is there any way that Assad could avoid being bombed? And I said declaratively, yes, he could get all the chemical weapons out of Syria. Foreign Minister Sergei Lavrov called me within a couple of hours and said, I heard what you said in London. We need to work on that. And the fact is, President Obama and President Putin had actually talked about it. We then went to work on it, and within a matter of days, we came to an agreement to get all of the chemical weapons out of Syria. So we, in effect, Charlie, Did he cut himself shaving? In reality, a lot? we achieved far more by what having said what's Obama, happening down there, getting all the chemical weapons out, but people There's straight lines. The so it looks going like to Congress as an avoidance of the bombing. And I will, they were really I will bad plastic surgeon? Right here. Is that what happened? Yes, it, it did hurt us. It took hold. Somehow there was this perception that the president would, had backed off. But well, the never. perception is if you say there's a red line, if you cross a red line, and you say you're going to attack if you cross a red line, and then you don't. Yeah, but what even was the though, I understand that. Even though you've got but what was the reason? The what was the reason for the red line? To get the, the chemical reason, weapons. No, no, not just that. It was to tell him, don't use these. Right. And we've got to try to get it. What was the best way for him not to use them? Take them away. So we actually accomplished the goal, you know, exponentially beyond what we would have by bombing. But I concede the fact of, of, of how it played out created this mythology and this perception that somehow the president wasn't willing to do that. Well, and, and I just don't think it was real. But it did cost us. I know it cost us. Because I heard it. Also saying we I didn't bomb it, Syria and, and enough. I had to argue it with many, many people. And you had to convince them it was not the reality that you were not there to back them up and support Well, them. that's one of the reasons why we built up what we built up with Camp David, with the assurance program, with the... Uh